What's going on? What's going on? It's your boy Kid Savage back at you again with enough another, another Street Beefs reaction. This time I'm coming with you, coming at you with Fetty versus Manu the Great. Fetty been out for a while now, and um, I don't know, maybe he was nursing an injury or just trying to get his skills up right or whatever the case. But he's back now. Um, he's former um, 155 MMA champ. Uh, yeah, he's former uh, 155 champ. Um, he defended his belt a good amount of times, whatnot. And uh, you know, yeah, he was a champ at one point in time, and I think he had lost it to Beach. Yeah, he had lost it to Beach. And then um, from there, I think Beach had kind of relinquished it. I don't know if he still got it or not, but yeah, F Fetty, uh, he's a grappling heavy fighter. He'll strike with you. He ain't got no problem with that. I remember one fight he had with some guy, he ended up knocking him out with a head kick. So yeah, he'll, he'll strike with you, but his bread and butter is uh, wrestling. So, um, yeah, you know, he's a wrestler going against our favorite Floridian fighter, Manu the Great. Manu the Great, you already know how he gets down. He's very grappling heavy as well. He don't really too much care for, uh, well, not saying that he don't care for striking, but, you know, he, he'll, he'll strike just to get in range, wrap up with you, take you down, and bring you into deep waters. Hold on. I open up the door for you first time. That darn on dog, but nah, yeah. My news, like, like I said, man, he's very durable, very conditioned, stamina is like damn near infinite. And uh, this matchup between him and Fetty, not gonna lie, it should be a very interesting one. Now, I'm not sure if this is a grappling match or an MMA match, but um, I'll adjust and say what's what. If I see fit. But besides all that, let's see what we got. Let's get into it. To it. Fetty always coming in heavy. Shout out to Fetty, man. You know, he's a monster. Y'all have seen him. I know you have. We're going to get the grappling in. It's going to be. Oh, so it's a grappling match. Okay, nice. Yeah, man. Haven't seen that in a while. Street Beast, we got a nice little jujitsu match here. Nice. Honor the great Fetty. Now they're 0 0 as far as grappling matches go. But both are Street Beast stars. So good luck, guys. 10 minutes, cap. Or it goes to tap. All right, guys, we're not starting up the case, so come on in. <laughs> Touch hands. Touch the hands. Touch the hands. Ready? Ready? Go. This is both their uh, repertoire, so this should be interesting. Ready to shoot for the takedown, the single leg. Manu tries to go for like a triangle, but end up sprawling out, scrambling out to a decent, more better position. I ain't gonna lie, Fetty kind of, Fetty's a real, real good wrestler, man. Real good wrestler. What none who should probably be doing from here is trying to, yeah. There you go, he did exactly what it is I thought. Nice little spin around, but Fetty was able to reverse it. Oh, it looked like he has a triangle. <laughs> Shit, I wouldn't have to told him I said that out loud, but I, I did it. We got to let the referee know. Fetty. Oh, wow, nice. I think he done worked on his jiu-jitsu throughout his time being uh, gone. 
Huh. Yeah, it looked like he must have worked on his jiu-jitsu because he used that triangle uh, triangle choke as a sweep. I don't know why they um, stood up. I couldn't see it because of the found phone acting up. Eight minutes in. This is setting up to be a very decent uh, grappling match. Their styles kind of like negate each other. This would make it interesting in the main match, but I think Fetty got like 20 pounds plus on uh, my new. Fetty working for the back. My new. Yeah, hey, nice. Nice. That was damn good. My new flipped him over off his back into side control. Fetty got the guard for the side control. He hipped out. Got into like a half butterfly guard. I don't know if Manu has like a choke or something. Probably not. He's just holding him there trying to regain some energy. He, pro he already had a match too, so bear that in mind as well. Yeah, it looked like they both just tired. They're trying to rest and get catch their breath. Looks. Nah, he didn't. He was probably just holding him there. Manu trying to work to get into a better position. Now he got a, he's in Fetty's guard, kind of. He's trying to pass, but he just stands up and let him stand up. Fetty again goes in for the shoot, gets the takedown. Moves, trying to move in the mount, but instead takes side control. Smart move, may have an arm triangle. Trying to sneak up for an arm triangle, and they got it. Oh, but he uses it to go to the back. He goes to the back for a rear naked choke. He's got one hook in, and my new doing a great job fighting it. He's sweet, he's sweet. Nice, man. I ain't gonna lie, man. This is a damn good uh, grappling match, man. If uh, Manu can make 155, this would be a hell of a good match. In the main match. But then you would have a problem. Because then I'm in 155. <laughs> yeah, then shout out to Manu. Shout out to Fetty. Yeah, that, that time away, man, really did do some uh, good for Fetty, man. Because it seemed like he, he um, worked a lot on his jujitsu. His wrestling was already on point, but now his jiu-jitsu is, is like damn near blue, be blue, belt, blue belt level. Nice sweep. Nice sweep. Freddy on top now. My new is uh, posturing up. Freddy trying to sink for a guillotine, but yeah, I don't think that, that was going to work. Not against somebody like my new anyway. He's isolating the arm, trying to go for Americana. Manu did a great job of circling out, went to his stomach and standing straight up again. And this is supposed to go 10 goddamn minutes. After a while, somebody got to give. Fetty again, shoot for the takedown. Man, like I said, man, Fetty's wrestling is ace. Like, I would say he's the, he's the best wrestler in uh, Street Beast, in my opinion. <laughs> My nigga talking hey, a little bit of shit. Say, beat. Fetty, keep going. Keep working, baby. No. Don't stop. Don't stop. Beat Twitty. Yeah, don't let him talk. Yeah, you got yoked up. Trying to talk smack. <laughs> Come on. All right. Yeah, uh-uh. Beat, Fetty. Y'all not doing this to me. Look. Y'all not doing this. He's a monster. I'll show y'all what y'all can't do. What would Ring say? I've okay. never seen a Steve Beast fighter okay. talk smack, get choked out, well not choked out, but get choked and then tap and then still get up till still talking smack. Manu is one of a kind. Good work, man. He already had one fight today, so don't take too much away from him. Good, good roll. We eventually gonna fight, man. MMA, just turn up. Let's go. Yeah, that'll be interesting for real, for real. I ain't gonna lie, that would be very entertaining. 
Yeah, I ain't gonna really give too much of my um, my take on that. Really, it was a really good grappling match. They both pretty much expert level, and if my new didn't slip up by you know talking to smack towards the camera and not paying attention, I believe it would have went all ten rounds and it would have been a draw. Probably would have had to go to a tap. But um, yeah, that was a real good grappling match. Man, I want to see more of these. Like they used to have them, not often, but they used to have them quite a lot. And um, I don't know who started it, but that was a good idea to implement that every now and then. Grappling matches here, kickboxing matches here and there. That was damn good. Even one time matches. So um, yeah, that, I, that was a pretty decent role, man. Hell of a good role. You got to see some some experienced grapplers do their thing. Um, yeah, I mean, that's, I ain't really got much else to say on that, man. It's been your boy Kid Savage with another Street Beast reaction. Peace. I got this shit covered. I run it pretty shy. I can make a death look ugly. Got the top, no wisdom in the mouth. Shit, we kinda.